New details tonight in the case of a missing retired teacher. 60 year old Marta Moreno was found lifeless yesterday. At an emotional press conference, San Benito's chief tearfully explained where they found her body and car. Local 23's Derek Garcia reports. Just give me a moment. San Benito's chief of police, Michael Galvan, is holding back tears. You know, you come in here thinking, you know, this is going to be easy just to read this thing, but. When you're there with the family, it's very tough. He fights to get through a prepared statement with details into the disappearance of a retired teacher, Marta Moreno. Uh, she had a daily routine that she never deviated, deviated from. The 60-year-old hadn't been seen since last Wednesday. She suffered from Alzheimer's and made a desperate call to family for help. She sounded scared and didn't know where she was and stated that she couldn't open the door. A cell phone tower hit narrowed the search. But after days of looking high and low for her and her white Honda Fit, the case took a tragic turn. A crop duster spotted Moreno's car in a ditch south of Williams Road under power lines, where search and rescue helicopters couldn't fly. She was outside the vehicle uh, by the passenger side door. Uh, door was closed, and she was just basically in a laying down position. You were so close. Yeah, we were so close. I mean, because we actually uh, came this far uh, up into that uh, bridge that you crossed. Mm -hmm. Um, but we never made it to this side. There was so much debris in the way, and we we're just kind of like, no, no way a car could fit in there. According to Chief Galvan, there are no signs of foul play, but an autopsy report has been ordered. Derek Garcia, Local 23 News. Funeral arrangements have not been released.